Hey, 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 guys, let me get out of this pricker's way. Oh my god. I am chill, dog. Fuck, fuck you. Oh, there goes, uh, there goes monetization for that video, if, if I even had that shit. <laughs> Either way. Um, anyways, how's it going, guys? Welcome back to another video for my channel. Uh, the, what, mm, English is hard. Okay. Anyways, welcome back to, this is a customization on the Enos Deity? I think it's the Enos Deity. Let me, let, let me make sure. Let me make sure. Yes, it is the Enos Deity. Holy shit. And it's a sedan. I am excited. I'm happy that I actually got that. So, I just did the Brioso, and I'm really excited for this one. This one is one that I've had in my garage since it was on sale about a week or two ago, and I'm really excited, man. This thing apparently is really good. I don't I don't trust people, and honestly, I, I hope it's a good car. But anyways, I'm going to start off the video by showing the price of this thing, because I don't ever remember to do that. And I always do it like mid-video, and I think people want it more in the middle, so people can like come in and be like, Oh yeah, I, I, know, I know where that's at now. So, let me just pop this bad boy. Um, Enos Deity, Enos Deity. Where are you at, buddy? Enos Deity, where you at? Where you at, buddy? Where are you at? Where are you at? Dog! Pulls! Okay, I think it's in a... Uh, Southern San Andreas. Vigoro, Karen, Arbiter, Ruiner, Postlude. Postlude? Yeah, whatever. Whatever you guys read that is. And where the frick is the deity? I'm going to cry if I can't find it again. Uh oh. Please, is it is it a four-door? I might be fucking up on that. Motherfucker. Okay. I just said I just said I was gonna get better about my language, but you know what? F you. Okay, so this is the Enus Deity. This is how much it cost. A base price of 1.4 mil, because I like to round up for you guys, because some people are specific about that. Um, but anyways, that is the price. I'm gonna go ahead and drive it to my agency, because there are agency upgrades, Imani Tech, whatever you wanna call it. I have a pretty good amount of money, so I'm hoping I can get all the upgrades required to get this thing popping off, baby. Now, I've done I've done upgrades on almost all the uh, Imani Tech, except for the Greenwood, I think is the name of it, and there's probably two or three more that I haven't done, but I don't think I did a Buffalo one. Hmm. Anyways, we're going to go ahead and just customize this bad boy because I heard this one was a cool one. So we got 26 options for this. What the fuck, man? That's actually awesome. Armor plating. Coolio. Coolio. Body trim. Yo. So we can do primary trim, we got secondary trim. Oh, it's just around the windows? Does it go around the back too? No. I'm gonna go carbon on that, that looks cool. All right, we're gonna do obviously race brakes, bumpers. Ooh, oh, we got quite a bit of the bumpers. Okay, I'm, I'm digging it already. So we got the secondary bumper, which is uh, oh, pretty much the same thing, just a uh, different color. Um, you got the street kit, you have the secondary street kit, you got the carbon street kit, you have the racer kit, secondary racer, and then carbon racer. I'm gonna do carbon because I like my bumpers in carbon sometimes. All right, so for the back bumper, you got the secondary, you have the carbon bumper, you have the aftermarket. Oh, I actually kind of like the aftermarket. It looks clean. You got the secondary, and then you got the carbon, baby. So I'm kind of hoping for skirts. I'm gonna do the I'm gonna do the carbon to just you know. All right, so engine upgrade. Oh, we got exhaust options. All right, so we got the carbon exhaust, which just make it carbon. Titanium, which make it rainbow colored. I like that. The aluminum exhaust. The oval. Wow. That actually fits the car really nice. I'm kind of going with the oval exhaust already. I kind of like the titanium and carbon. There's the aluminium oval exhaust. You have the infin. Ooh, that actually kind of fits it too. Damn, okay. I really like the exhaust options on this so far. 
I, I, oh, this hurts me. Um, I'm gonna go with the aluminium one. I kind of like that. All right, then there's the grill options. Ooh, you got the chrome, you got the primary pinstripe, you got the secondary pinstripe, you got the carbon chrome, you got the recessed grill, chrome recessed, you got the slatted grill, carbon slatted, luxury. Ooh, I kind of like the luxury grill. Ooh, makes it look more luxurious. Look, luxur luxurious? Luxurious. Then you got 14 options for the hood. You got the carbon hood, which I'm not going to do. There's a primary pinstripe hood, which makes it look even more luxurious. And then you got the secondary, you got the carbon, you got the chrome, which I'm already digging the chrome on that. Looks pretty clean. You got the ridge line hood, you got the carbon ridge line, you got the inset hood, you got the carbon inset, and then you got the performance hood, carbon performance hood, vented. Vented looks nice. Um, I'm honestly thinking the uh, chrome pinstripe looks clean as hell I, I love that look makes it look even more luxurious with the uh with the grill too um i actually have no clue what this car is based on let me check that out actually one second you guys i i should have this pulled up um okay yeah there, there it is i knew it was based off of a car that i knew um so this one is based off of the Bentley Flying Spur, which is really fucking luxurious. A lot of people are like, oh, well, Bentley's are, is always going to be luxurious. Of course, I know that. I, I never, I've never driven a Bentley, but I have wanted one since I was a little kid. Um, you got the lights, which obviously headlights, xenon, uh, neon kit. I'm going to wait because this is, is going to be my luxury car that I drive around no matter what. Um, so with liveries, I'm not a big livery fan on Bentleys, but I'm going to take a look. Red stripes look okay. White stripes. You got the black stripes. You got the white. Ooh, that looks clean. Got, ooh, I really, ooh, I love the white on that. That's clean as hell, man. This is this Santa Nova gold. Ooh, clean as hell, man. The modern art on it. You got the her Majesty Kronos. Okay. What is this? The Incredibles? <laughs> um, I'm honestly... Like, I don't like liveries very much, but a clean white... Ooh. And then there's the little white around the... The, uh, the head... And the tail light. Yo! I'm going white pinstripe. That looks nice. I, I will take it. I'm not a livery fan. You guys should know this. Yellow on black. Wait. Is there... And I like it on black. That's the only... Wait. Yeah, 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 that's the only one that kind of fits it. Oh, you could ma you could put guns on this thing? Let's go. Machine guns, obviously. This is going to be my fucking... Hmm. Love this thing already. I'm going to throw on slick mines because I don't think many people are going to enjoy that. Oh, we got some roof options. So you got the primary roof. You got the secondary. You got the carbon roof. You got the ridge line. Secondary ridge line. The carbon ridge line. You got the inset roof, which actually makes it look pretty clean. I like the inset. You got the secondary, and then you got the carbon inset. I'm obviously going to go with a really nice just inset roof, just because it's a uh, love Bentley, man. They're, they're pretty fucking clean. Yes, we can do the skirts. Let's go. Let's fucking go. Okay, now I've done enough spinning. Now I'm dizzy. <laughs> but there's a carbon. There's carbon skirts, which look plenty, plenty clean. The primary skirt lip. Secondary, you got the carbon. You got the street skirt. You have the carbon street. You got the street skirt kit. You got the carbon. You got the aftermarket. You have the carbon aftermarket. The aftermarket aftermarket skirt kit. That was a big old tongue twister. And then you got the carbon. Um, I'm obviously gonna go with the carbons. Kind of fit with the back and the front a little bit because I like the carbon aftermarket looks. I don't know. I just like that look, man. It's very clean and it looks clean. It's super hell 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 clean. You got 19 options for spoilers. This is going to ruin the car, isn't it? So you got the lip spoiler, which is just base kind of thing going on there. You got the secondary, you got the carbon, and then you got the flat duck tail, which actually doesn't look too bad. It's not terrible looking. You got the car, you got the secondary, you got the carbon, and then you got the primary duck lip. It's just extends it a little bit. That's not too bad. There's the secondary, and then there's the carbon. Um, you got the street spoiler, which kind of makes it more racy, kind of, eh. 
Um, you got the GT wing, which makes it more, even more racy and GT like. Um, you got the performance spoiler, which is. Eh. I'm honestly just gonna go with the primary ducktail because I think that looks the best on it. Suspension, where uh, we don't want to drop it too low. How's the wheels looking? Uh, yeah. Once you kind of drop it there, it kind of loses its uh, look there. I, I'm just gonna do a little bit lower, just for a little bit of a smoother ride. You got the race transmission, obviously. You got the turbo on it. You, you gotta have it, man. All right, so wheel type. You can, if you do not put your freaking high end wheels on this, I will flip my shit. I will flip it, man. I will freak the fuck out. Okay, I think I've had, I think I need to stop doing that. I, I I've done that a little bit too much in this video already. I've already gone crazy enough as it is today. But either way, I'm having fun with it. You guys can deal with it if you have a problem. There's the blade, there's, I'm not gonna go through all these. You guys obviously are gonna know this if you guys are into customization of cars. Um, hmm. I want this to be very clean and nice looking. I'm gonna go with diamond because this is gonna be my luxury car, okay? You can judge me elsewhere, okay? Ooh, we, we gonna wait on the color, man. Enhancements, bulletproof. This is gonna be my freaking car, man. I, I'm, I'm loving this thing. We're gonna do black on that because I like the black. Bentley should be black, man. Bentley should be black. Bentley should be black. I'm gonna make a song out of that, baby. I'm gonna make a freaking song out of that. Holy shit, we got some options for color. All right, all right, all right. Um, we're gonna look at chrome because I know some people are into that. Uh, I'm not into it. Um, you got the chameleon, which... Uh, Mm, eh, mm, mm, eh, eh. Mm, not a fan kind of like that though that's pretty clean looking uh but the rest are kind of iffy i like the dark blue though it kind of accentuates the white a little bit and kind of makes it shiny no nah, i'm not doing it though metallic um you got the carbon you got the graph you guys know all these colors man if you guys don't there's a problem um huh do I go with a nice blue or something crazy? I know some people are gonna be like, oh, you shouldn't do it in that color. I kinda wanna do uh I wanna do a frost white. You can still see the livery a little bit, but also kinda like the like to see the livery a little bit better. Um, I think I'm gonna go with uh whatever that word is. I'm I I have a southern educa I have southern education, okay? I am terrible with this shit. Ooh, we could change the mirrors to okay. Uh, maybe we could do a gold. I've never done gold on some mirrors, man. I, I, no, 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 no! I will not do it. Don't do it. Don't motherfucking do it. I'm gonna do a frost white. Just a no. I'm gonna do ice white just to match the livery a little bit. And the trim color I'm gonna do a white because I like the color white wow that's gonna be terrible in the long run but whatever screw you okay color I like all colors okay I have I love a lot of colors Ooh. Ooh. oh don't you get me started baby I'm gonna go midnight purple on that just a little subtle hint of purple because I like the color purple I'll give you a frickin' purple durple! Ooh! Don't, don't be playing, baby. Don't be playing. A dog! My new paint job! All right, my new paint job has ruined me. Why you gotta do that? Ooh. Anyways, we're gonna drive this a little bit. We're gonna have some fun with it. I know some people are more into the driving aspect of it, and honestly, this thing drives pretty clean, man. Excuse me, get out of the way. Lug luxury broke bitch here. I only have uh, $198,000, but you know what? I'm balling on a budget. Wee! Yeah, this one is definitely going to be my new luxury car. It is a very clean looking car. Oh God, that turn radius is ass. Okay. Takeoff's okay. It's not too bad. Excuse me, coming through. All right. 
Let me kind of get some speed here, baby. We gonna get up to speed. I don't see here any more shifts, so I'm gonna assume that was a pretty good speed on it. Um, obviously, I really like this car. There's a little bit of understeer, really bad understeer, but it's a luxury car, so there shouldn't be there shouldn't be any. It should have a little bit of understeer because it is a luxury car. It's a Bentley, bruh. It's a clean ass Bentley. Anyways. I'm going to go ahead and park it right here and kind of talk about it a little bit more. Hey, what's up? Really? You had to do it, man. Fine, I'll park it. Give me a second. Good lord. I'll park it like a normal human being, you asshole. I'm a selfish human being, I know. Oh. Okay. So, to kind of go... Don't you ding... Don't you ding it. Don't you fucking dig it! <laughs> oh my god! I have never seen that! Oh my god! That's too good! Oh my god, he didn't want to fuck up his Corvette, bro. <laughs> that was fucking awesome. I have never seen a freaking dude do that. I respect the grind, bro. I think you respected me more than you respected yourself with how you fucking parked all fucking crooked. Fuck your Corvette, dog. Actually, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Hold up. Let, me, uh, let, me, let me be an asshole here. Let me just be an asshole. Ruining my shit! Yeah, I'ma fuck up your- I'm, I'm, I'ma fuck up your vet. I'ma fuck up your vet! Okay, anyways, I got a little distracted there. Um... <laughs> oh no! <laughs> oh my god, that was- Anyways, that, may, that, would, that makes for a really fucking great moment. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and just- WHAT?! This is bullshit! Why do you do this to me? Why? I just had to drive a little bit so I can drive into my garage. Anyways, this is going into my garage because this is my luxury car. These are cars that I'm going to use every single day. You guys can see my uh, utility truck here just for the purpose. I have my favorite car and then I have the deluxe one. And then I usually have a oppressor mark two in here, but I destroyed it in the last video and I have yet to touch it. And then of course you have my baby, which is my daily driver if I don't want to drive anything else. But this one is gonna be my luxury one if I decide to just go drive around the hills, you know? So, oh man, um, I'm gonna give a personal rating and a just a rating that should be a little bit less biased. Um. To start out, it is a Bentley, and I think a lot of people love Bentleys in any situation. A lot of people in GTA were like, oh, yo, we haven't gotten a freaking Bentley. We got a Bentley now, baby. We, 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 we Bentley boys out here, baby. Mm. But anyways, um, I love how this car customized. There's so many options. A lot of people are going to be like, oh, but it's an agency car you could put in Monty Tech. That's kind of broken. It's a luxury car. It's a Monty Tech. And it has guns on it, and it has the slicks, and it's still a freaking high-end car. It th This is literally one of the freaking things that a lot of people probably ask for. I have no clue. I don't talk to people who play GTA very much, but I talk to very... I talk to one, maybe. That's it. But, I don't know. This car is amazing. I love this car, and I'm definitely keeping it forever. This is one of my personal favorites now, because I've always wanted a Bentley in this game, and I just now found out that this is a Bentley. Like, there's this is literally a Bentley. Like, no one else... You can't even argue it. I know some of it's more racy and kind of a... Uh, oh, I'm gonna race this car, but, you know, it's a, it's a luxury car. Don't race it, man. I love the livery on it. I've never loved a livery on a car so much. This is this is clean, prime, and honestly, I think the diamond fits so damn well with the livery and 
and the inside and everything. Oh, it's such a pretty car. Um, so personal rating, I'm going to go with first because I know some people are going to be like, oh, what's your personal rating on this? Um, I'm going to have to give this a 9.8. It's a it's luxury, man. I love to drive in this thing. I've never, I never had a problem driving it. And honestly, I think that situation outside was fucking hilarious. That is the funniest thing I've ever had on video. But anyways, um, for a little bit more of a logical, non-biased rating, I'm going to have to give this a 7.6 because there's some things that I wish there was better options on. I wish they had a... I wish the little line going from the hood would transfer to the top and would work with the grill a little bit more. It looks very luxurious on the front, very luxurious on the hood, and then the then the roof just kind of turn into race, race car stuff. And then the back, luxury again. But I don't know. You guys tell me. Do you guys like this car? Tell me in the comments and let me know what you guys want to see out of my next customization. And while you're down there, Hit that like button, man. And I'd appreciate every like, every view, every subscriber. You know I do if you watch my content before. But if you haven't, welcome. I, ho I hope you guys stay a while and I hope you guys enjoy this content because I, I think that was the funniest shit I've ever had on a customization video. So anyways, like I said, hit that like button, comment, and subscribe if you guys haven't yet. I know most of y'all aren't subscribed, so hey, I'd appreciate it and I'd love to have you. So... Anyways, I will see you guys in the next video or live stream. Peace out, you guys.